Hi guys, welcome to another video from Flying Higher. Today we are in Florida and we are on the world's largest, newest cruise ship by Royal Caribbean, Wonder of the Seas. And we'll be on it for seven nights. So I'm going to show you in this video what an ocean view balcony cabin looks like on board the newest, largest ship in the world. This cabin number is deck 6, uh, 6258 and it's located on the port side midship. So right now we are outside the cabin and all the doors are blue on board Wonder of the Seas if you were wondering. Looking at the cabin, the configuration is similar to all the other ships in Royal Caribbean's fleet and you got a full length mirror over there and the thing about the bathroom door is that there's a magnetic strip to open instead of a handle and I've been hearing quite a lot of complaints that it's been quite a hard um, thing to open. For those wondering, there's a lot of shelving on the right hand side of the sink as well as underneath and the shower cubicles are slightly rounded. I think that gives it a bit of more room for those showering inside. So coming into the main cabin, on the right hand side of the couch, we have a hanging wardrobe where you can put your suits, your dresses, luggage, anything like that. And this couch in the center uh, folds out into a sofa bed which your stateroom attendant will set up if necessary. So this is the vanity dressing area and as you can see there are many uh, sheets of information regarding your cruise vacation such as the daily cruise compass and maybe a promotion uh, letter from Casino Royale. And here we have the different types of plugs you can find on board uh, in these staterooms. There's two American, one European, and uh, another American and European on the right hand side with two USB C plugs in the center. And now in my cabin, waiting for me are my uh, cookies and water that is part of the uh, Crown and Anchor Society perks for being a platinum member. There's also more storage in the drawers in the dresser and underneath that is the mini bar which is a standard mini bar fridge size as most hotel rooms. And on the left hand side of the couch there is more shelves and a slightly more wardrobe space with a safe. So coming to the bed area, there are two side tables on either side of the queen size bed. The right side has plugs and the left side has a telephone, so keep that in mind. Of course, if you are wanting to sleep in a twin configuration, you can request that from your stateroom attendant upon boarding uh, when you meet them on the first day. So here are some gifts that the team gave us, a Wonder of the Seas flag, a Wonder of the Seas uh, information card, and some brochures as well, and a Wonder of the Seas cap, which is very nice of them. I think before boarding, my biggest concern was that these hooks, um, they were too simplistic in like the uh, interior designing of the cabin but they are actually very useful. I found many uses for them including hanging my lanyards, hanging my tote bags after coming back from a day at port and I'm sure you can use it for many other uh, different uses such as hanging um, shoe bags and other things like that. And now for the most awaited part of the balcony ocean view stateroom tour. The balcony of course. So this is a standard balcony with two chairs and a mini side table for you to have a cocktail or breakfast room service. And we are on Fort Lauderdale Port Everglades and we'll be sailing out shortly. Do like, comment and subscribe to my channel if you like this content and I'll be sure to post more soon. See you!